Hello friends, welcome to this video. I am pumped. Um, these are actually my favorite videos to film. The like binder related videos and I think you guys enjoy them too because they do well on my channel. So anyway, but I'm so excited. So I'm finally reorganizing my 80s binder. So I bought more binders as you can see. I have a ridiculous amount of binders now. But anyway, so I bought a few with more three inch binders. I ordered them all online. The Office Depot brand is my favorite brand. I'll link almost everything down below for you guys that I use and that you will see in this video. But anyway, so I bought another three inch binder for AT and then I bought another colored binder so that I can separate some things. The colored binders I like to use for um, bigger inclusions. So bigger inclusions are colored and then my like photo card collections are all in white binders. That's how I have it currently and that's how I really have been liking it. But anyway, we're going to start off with ATs. This here is my ginormous ATs binder. Sorry if the camera's shaking a lot, but as you can see, it's already full. This is a three inch binder, you guys, and it's already packed. <laughs> it's kind of insane. I'm not going to lie to you guys. So what I'm going to do, oh, by the way, I have like these cute holographic stickers for all my binders that say like ATs or whatever group it is and I'm sorry for this huge glare but it's not like my collection video so I kind of don't care that there's a huge glare like with the photo cards um but anywho so what I'm gonna do is oh okay <laughs> let me think so I'm gonna I think only keep their album photo cards in here so I have quite a few albums I'm gonna be doing a storing my photo cards video right after this too because I have over 200 photo cards to store anyway <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna take out all of this so these are all pobs and other photo cards I have it's mostly all pobs but I also have like their light stick their season songs random other photo cards like sub k merch and such so that's all in um, here, and so that's kind of what I'm going to do. Take them all out and put it in the other 3-inch. I even made my thing to put inside of, like, the side of the binder. It says 80s bobs. It's a little crooked, but who really cares? So let's take out everything. Like I said, oh, this glare is so annoying, but there's not much I can do. <laughs> I need lighting. Okay, how am I going to do this? Okay, those are all albums. So I guess I'll just do it this way. I just need more room. I feel like they're going to have a comeback here soon. And I just, I need all the room I can get. So that's why I've been wanting to do this for a bit though. Like have two separate binders for their photo cards. So it's more organized that way. Okay, so there we go. Now... In here will just be all of their album photo cards. Let's see how much room I have after taking them all out. Let's. OMG, look at that. That's so much space. Yay, that makes me so happy. Now they can do all the, okay. I was gonna say they can do all the comebacks that they want, but like not really. So this one will be for their pops and such. I'll take this out. I don't have covers for any of my binders and I kind of like it that way. So I might keep it like this for now. Okay, I think I can do a few at a time. So yes, this will, it says 80s pops on the side, but it's gonna also have like other random photo cards. <laughs> like there's sub K merch photo cards in here. Their season songs photo cards will be in here. I was thinking about keeping their season songs with like their album photo cards, but I think it's just going to be Korean releases in the other binder. Then we move on to Pobs, which I'll talk more about how, well, actually I'll talk about it in this video and probably my storing photo cards video, how I'm doing Pobs now. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize I had this many, to be honest. Like, I knew I did, but at the same time, a lot of it's kind of empty just because I don't have all the photo cards that I want yet. Okay, 
I cannot believe I have this this many 80s photo cards that I need a freaking other three inch binder. Like that's kind of insane. Imagine if I collected OT8 pobs. I mean, I did a few sets, but like imagine if I always like every single pob I collected OT8. That would be crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is already kind of full. I have a lot of pobs. Jeez, I didn't know that. Oh, this is really heavy. Okay, so I'm gonna actually put this in the side. There we go. It says AT's pods now. <laughs> so, okay, what I wanted to explain real quick is how I'm organizing. Ugh, the glare, it's so bad. I know some people complained on my prior video, so I actually have like a different tripod to like film binder related videos, but I'm too lazy to set that up right now, so I'll do that later um, for my storing photo cards video. But anyway, so I kind of have, there are pops in the front, so we have like Zero Fever Part 2, and then it moves on to Zero Fever Part 3, and I have quite a few Zero Fever Part 3 sets. And then it moves on to, this will be epilogue, so I'll be storing my epilogue pods here, and then it's the, then it moves on to Sungwa. So for Sungwa, I used to collect a nine pocket for him for Zero Fever Part 2, and then I was doing the same thing for Zero Fever Part 3. I have a lot of these on the way, but um, I stopped collecting him for epilogue just because his photo cards are really expensive. I've talked about this before. And yeah, I just don't, it's not in the budget <laughs> to collect Sungwa. He is my bias in 80s. And then we move on to, um, you know who I'm, who's one of my wreckers. I have two wreckers in 80s. I'm going to try to collect all of his pops or the majority. The only ones I don't want to collect are Lucky Draws just because they're really thick and I'm not the biggest fan of them. And there was something else unit PCs. I don't plan on collecting all of those. They're unit like fan sign cards. But yeah, starting with the wave air, I'm going to attempt this, but as you can see, it's quite empty. So these are all for you know. He has so many paws. And then I'm also going to be doing Wu Young. So his are like blue sticky notes. So yes, I'm going to attempt to also collect Wu Young. And then this is where we get into like other things like other random photo cards. So that's how this one's laid out. And then they're my other binder is strictly just going to be their Korean album releases. So I changed the angle and you shouldn't see a glare hopefully. I decided to just do it in this video. Sorry the AT section was there was a glare but anyway. Um, so the next thing I need to reorganize is this binder is called <laughs> Other Faves and in here I just have groups like Stray Kids, Very Very, and Hypen and TXT um, and I collect certain members for them. So I like to keep them in their own binder, but it's a two inch binder and I'm going to change it to a three inch, not because I'm running out of space, just because I need this two inch binder for something else. So I'm going to do that. So basically just putting all of these photo cards in here so that I can use this three inch binder for them instead. Plus maybe I'll be adding like more groups in here one day. I don't freaking know taking them all out oh my gosh I am <laughs> I feel like I just put these in here and now I'm taking them all out but you know what that's how it is sometimes so yeah I keep so for stray kids I collect Mino <laughs> if I start collecting Soongmin I don't want to hear it <laughs> Don't even talk about, we won't even talk about that if I do ever start collecting Soongmin. Um, yeah, I'm going through it with Stray Kids. Anyway, and then for Very Very, I collect Yunho. And I feel, I'm pretty happy collecting him. I love that man. <laughs> like, truly just love him. So I'll put them all in here. And then, I'm trying to think, oh yeah, I have TXT in there. Oops. Was this? Yeah. Okay. I have TXT and I collect Yunjun and I love that man, but he's so freaking expensive. <laughs> like truly, I'm like, ooh. And then for an hypen, I collect Jake. So that's who I collect if you were curious for this binder. Maybe you weren't, but here we are. <laughs> I'm kind of like, I really want to collect Taeyeon from, um, 
Oh, crap. I really want to collect Taeyeon from TXT, if I'm being honest. He's my bias wrecker. But TXT photo cards are kind of expensive. <laughs> if Niyokio still carried um, Makari Japan, I am so upset about that, by the way. I am devastated. But anyway, if Niyokio still had a Makari Japan, I would probably, I'm not going to lie, collect Taeyeon. Just because on Niyokio Japan, or Niyokio. On Mercari Japan, they're pretty inexpensive. Taeyeon is anyway. Even USA Mercari is pretty inexpensive. Yeonjun, on the other hand, <laughs> that man's expensive. But I'm grateful that um, TXT, they don't do too many photo cards per album, which is so nice for me. Because, like I said, Yeonjun is expensive. I know Suvin is really expensive too. And then Mino from Stray Kids can be expensive. Well, actually, his photo cards aren't really that bad, if you think about it. He is, like, a popular member, so trading for him is difficult. But, like, actually buying his photo cards, it's not bad. Like, truly. Okay, so now I have skids in here. Yay! And my other faves. I will change out, like, the sides and stuff in a second. Now I have the two-inch binder back, and... In here, I am going to put what's in this binder. So I don't, I used to really like these binders. I think it's only like a half inch or an inch binder though. So I'm going to put all the groups that I don't collect a certain member. You're probably thinking, what the heck, you have Hoshi. <laughs> don't you collect Hoshi? That was back in the day when I wanted to collect Hoshi, but then I changed my mind. <laughs> so I, I, okay, let's see who I have. I have 17 in here. Kingdom, who I don't collect anyone. SF9, I don't collect any certain member. Um, NCT, I also don't collect a certain member. However, I did collect one or two OT9 sets. They're jewel case stuff. And then I just keep their bigger items in the back, which I do plan on keeping in the white binder, even though I said I like to use colored binders for their bigger inclusions to kind of like differentiate them. But I've decided to just keep them in that two inch just because it's a two inch binder so like it'll fit oh i'm so excited to <laughs> finally have a white binder for them because it's taken me a bit of time oh gosh oh they're like all different <laughs> so i kind of have to do this one by one Yeah, as you can see, I used to collect Hoshi because he was my bias, but then I ended up like changing biases real quick. I don't even have a real bias in 17 because I cannot choose for the life of me. Okay, there we have that. So now we can put their photo cards. I also need to change out the fillers. I used to use like colored fillers too, but I like the white. It looks more cohesive, I feel. And then I'm also going to be adding more groups to this binder. Like Pentagon's going to be in here because I'm not collecting a certain number. Um, I don't remember who else is going in here, but... Maybe just Pentagon for now. I really want to buy Omega X <laughs> albums. Like, so bad. I love Omega X. However, I'm currently just financially can't do that. I financially can't afford to collect Omega X right now. <laughs> I love Kingdom 2 and they're having a comeback and it's Don's comeback. Like it's so around the theme is Don. <laughs> like it's basically his comeback. I'm so excited, but I'm probably not going to buy it right away. Like I said, financially I'm struggling. <laughs> um, it's just because school, you know. It's a busy time for me during school and I just don't have the money right now. So I'm just going to wait until I graduate, which is so exciting <laughs> that I'm graduating. Okay, I think that's it because then we have this. Okay, yay. Okay, then there's just one last thing to do. The very last thing that I've got to do is, so I have my almost alt in this binder. Oh, let me take that out. Okay, so in here I have P1 Harmony. Um, Victon will be going in here. I haven't stored their photo cards yet. I plan on doing, like, a whole video for them. And then, 
I was gonna call them stray kids. Oh my god, shiny. <laughs> Where am I? Anyway, I keep currently their bigger items in here, but I'm actually going to take them out and put them in their own binder. Just because I don't like keeping them in here. <laughs> so let's do it that way. I don't have a whole lot for them though, like bigger item stuff. But I do want them to have their own binder. Okay, so Victon. Oh, I forgot. I do have bigger items for Victon. So they'll be going out. P1 Harmony isn't even an almost alt. They are an alt for me. But I just keep them in this binder because they don't have that many photo cards and releases for me to give them their own binder. Like, I would need like a half inch binder for them. <laughs> and I just feel like that's a waste of money. I already have a bunch of half inch binders. Whatever. I need to take out these white pages. Oh well, we'll do that some other time. <laughs> Wow, this binder got real thin, real fast. <laughs> it's really thin. Okay, so for my almost alts, I want to give them this green one, which is, I love green. Green is like my favorite color. So it's just fitting that my almost alts get a green binder. And it's like a really pretty, like, I don't even know what color green this is, but it's pretty. Okay, so I'm going to put them in the same order as I did the others. So it'll be shiny in the back y'all just wait for victim to become an alt <laughs> i'm like waiting i feel like it's gonna happen here soon i love victim so freaking much like a lot <laughs> okay so here we have it i mean i don't have a whole lot for them for any of these groups but i just felt like it's necessary to give them their own binder for bigger inclusions just in case they do release a bunch of bigger items okay there we go and that's actually all i need to reorganize i mean it was a lot but so yeah i guess i'll end it on here i'll end it here this cute little standees <laughs> but anyway thank you guys so much for watching and please look forward to my next video, which will be storing over 260 photo cards. I'm insane. I haven't done a storing my photo cards video since like December or something like that. So it's long overdue, as you can see. I have so many. This right here is all 80s, this half. And I actually have more that didn't fit in here. Anyway, that'll be, I don't know when I'm going to post that video, but please look forward to it. I'm filming it right after this one. So thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you want to, and I will see you guys in the next one.